Hey guys, it's Ronald up here. I want to give you all a quick little review on the helmet I've been using for the past year. It's the uh, Speed and Strength SS1300. Um, I've tried a lot of helmets in the past and this one here works best for me so far. Um, um, I'm not getting paid by any means to promote this helmet or through Speed and Strength or nothing like that. I just want to give you all my little review on what I've experienced with this helmet. This is the uh, dark tin visor I bought with it. Um, I put the Honda sticker on it myself and the squid sticker, just a silly, real, silly little reminder. Um, but I really love it during the daytime. It's really, really good. Um, don't get caught out at night with it because it is dark. So it's very reasonable, very easy to change. So I recommend that. You know, for daytime use, um, uh, this is a clear visor that came with it. Um, I kept my helmet dirty just because I wanted to show everybody the fairness and honest with it. Um, what I really like about it is is the quick change. How I can change the visors out really quick. You just snap this over, twist it counterclockwise, this side and this side. You know. And this side, this side here, you'll do it clockwise. You know, both sides will go straight up, and then pull it out, and the visor will come straight off. I'll do a separate video on how to do how to do all that. Um, and then it comes off, and put your other one on, snap that back on, you're good to go. Um, I really love how um, when the visor's open in the front, it really, really, really breathes out a lot right here through these little airports I guess you would call it I'm not sure what whatever um, but I like that on a hot day man you're riding it really throws up a lot of air up into your mask and it also keeps it from fogging up in the morning times and things like that when we have a lot of humidity um, the, the other part I really like is the quick release right here helmet um, I really like it you know you just pull it well only got one hand so it's hard to do but anyways you just pull it like that and then slide it right back through whenever you're ready to go um, the insides on it are the ear pieces are interchangeable and I think the headrest is too I'm not sure but I know for a fact these ear pieces are like if you need a little bit more room width or height vice versa um, one thing that really led me to this helmet was, is um, I had a um, actually another speed and strength helmet, but it was a, a different model. I think it was the 1200. Forgive me. And I loved the way it felt, loved the way it breathed, but it had a tendency to get really loose in the jaw area. I have a tendency to, because I ride with only one mirror on the left side. Um, to look for traffic left or right and over a period of time it, the, the helmet would want to start to wiggle left to right and I didn't like that and they got old and aggravated this one here has not done that yet and I've had it over a year the first one it done it to me within five months and it was just irritating everybody said the helmet was too big I even tried a smaller size and it's still done it over a period of time so I've tried icons and everything but Everybody's different, you know, pick your poison, but this helmet here has worked the best for me. I love the fit in it. Um, but like I say, this is just my experience with it. I um, just want to share it with you guys. So, anyways, hope you like it. Thank you.